Hi everyone, for today's video I'm trying the Maybelline Express Remover. So basically this is a bottle that contains matte polish remover. I haven't opened it yet. Um, I just bought it down the road at Chemist Warehouse for $5 as it's Boxing Day and everything's half price for Maybelline. So the way it works is you're meant to dip your finger in with the nail polish on it, turn it and then remove your finger of course and then close the jar when you're done. So let's open it up and see what it smells like. So it smells really strong. <coughs> it smells like nail polish remover. Um, according to the bottle it's acetone free. So usually when I remove my nail polish I paint oil around the cuticles first but I won't for the first attempt just so we can see how the product works without any oil or anything added to it and that's how it looks inside so it might be hard to get this to zoom but it basically just looks like a sponge a black sponge with a hole in the middle so I'll dip and I'm not going to speed up the footage or anything I'm just going to leave this normal so that you can see how well it works so it doesn't work and then I'm going to turn Oops. maybe I'll turn the bottle around twice just to make sure and remove. Oh, that worked quite well. Okay, so then I might just dip and turn a few more times. Okay, so that worked pretty well. So now I'm going to do another finger with a bit of oil around the cuticle first because that's what I like to do to look after my cuticles. So I've just got this cuticle oil and then what I usually do, I'm just going to lower my camera, is I usually paint it around the edge Like so. Not a lot, just enough to protect your skin because I don't like having dry cuticles after I remove my nail polish. So now that I've done that, we'll try again. Okay, dip. It feels very wet inside the bottle. You can tell there's loads of nail polish remover inside. Turn. I don't know if I've turned enough and remove okay looks like I need to dip and turn a little bit more cool okay so that worked really well so there's basically no no polish or a tiny bit left on that nail but not much at all so I'll do one more attempt so I'm quite impressed I think this is an effective product um, because if you're on the go like if you needed to keep one at your desk at work for example and you didn't want to have chipped nails when you're in the office you could keep this in your drawer and then those emergency removals um, I think you'd always need a bottle of nail polish remover in your cupboard as well because you couldn't use this for your toes like I don't think it would work for your toes because you'd be able to get your toes in the right angle <laughs> into the bottle <laughs> um, and in terms of how my fingers feel it's not overly drying like it doesn't feel worse than regular nail polish it feels pretty much the same and the smell is now that it, like I'm not sniffing straight from the bottle the smell's not that strong at all so I'll continue to remove all of my fingers um, so this is definitely a first impressions video because I've only just bought the bottle so um, I'll have to come back in a few months and tell you how well it performs in terms of long-term use um, and glitter polish as well but I thought that as I've just purchased it today and, you know, only paid $5 for it, I thought that it would be nice to make a video for my viewers. Um, and yeah, my nail polish chipped a bit yesterday because um, it was Christmas Day and I did a lot of cooking. And so, and I'm on holidays now, so I thought, well, why not take off my nail polish and paint them all over again? So I hope you enjoyed watching my video. Uh, please thumbs up if you liked it and subscribe to my channel. Thank you. Bye.